Hey guys, today I'm going to be showing you how to delete iTunes duplicate tracks using CopyTrans Toontastic. With CopyTrans Toontastic, you're able to repair or remove iTunes missing tracks, locate orphan tracks that aren't currently listed in your iTunes library, or delete duplicate tracks that are just taking up pointless space. So let's get started. First, you're going to want to open CopyTrans Toontastic. If you don't already have it downloaded, go ahead and click on the link in the description to download it. Now click the button that says automatic. From there, you're going to want to click on the eyeball next to the menu that says however many albums contain however many duplicate tracks. And let's go ahead and click on one of the albums displayed. Now you can see individual tracks and their duplicates listed next to them. Notice that one of the tracks features a number of small metal icons. For example, the first medal you see indicates that the track is overall the best copy found, and the second medal shows that it was the first of the two tracks added into iTunes. Now, there are additional sets of medals that can appear, such as Best Rating, Most Played Track, and Track Found in Media Folder. With these ratings in mind, we're going to go ahead and delete the second one. In order to delete a track, you're going to need to click on the cogwheel on the right side of a track and click Remove from iTunes and Move to Trash. Now the cool thing about this is if you accidentally deleted the wrong track, you can go back to the cogwheel and press undo. An alternative to this method is going to the cogwheel and clicking keep only this one. This simply keeps the track that you clicked on and deletes the other one. And when you're done with that, you just click the cogwheel on the top with the check mark. And there you have it. That's how you delete iTunes duplicate tracks within CopyTrans Toontastic. Now we'll go ahead and open iTunes up just to show you that it worked. As you can see here, there are currently no duplicate tracks in iTunes. Now this is not only an extremely effective way to delete duplicate tracks, but it is much quicker and it significantly reduces the hassle of trying to figure out which track is the original and which is the duplicate. And that's all. Thanks for watching, and I hope you have fun deleting all of your iTunes duplicate tracks.